There's been a lot of interesting things going on with the Steam Next Fest, like game announcements and demos dropping, but all I gotta say is, how was I not aware that there was gonna be a sequel to Alien Hominid? What the heck? I love that original game on the, I played it on the GameCube, I remember, back in like, what was it, like 2004, 2005? And then I played it on the 360 quite a bit as well. But the company who makes this game, The Behemoth, they have a lot of cool stuff. Uh, Battle Block Theater, I really enjoyed that one. Uh, Castle Crashers, really excellent game. Played the crap out of that one. But I, I did like uh, the original Alien Hominid. I even played it on the uh, Game Boy Advance. It was released on a few different systems. PS2, GameCube, Game Boy Advance, uh, you know, Xbox 360. So there's a lot of access to this game. But it was pretty sweet. Now they got a new one coming out this year. And you can download the demo. Link will be down below if you want to easily get to this page and download it. Plan release date is this year. They have some information down here. Four players online or off. So that is pretty sweet. Help Mothership invade the Earth, facing down all new enemies and bosses. Three difficulty levels, which it looks like it's all based on uh, per player uh, on their health. Like 200% health, 100% health, or 40% health. Um, difficulty levels set per player. One player can be on friendly. One on insane, no problem. That's kind of neat. That's kind of neat. Uh, master alien acrobatics at your own pace. Flipping, diving, grenade jumping, head riding, down shooting, dodging, tossing enemies. So this is going to be pretty cool. Modifiers and whatnot. Let, let's go ahead and jump right into this because I, I want to check this out. I'm ready. Let me get my controller turned on. Choose your starting blocks. So this kind of, you know, hey, which path do you want to go down? Let's go. What happened to them? Not as purple ice creams? The hell? Oh shit. <laughs> Complete objectives to allow extraction. Okay, difficulty rises with time. Wow, okay. Dude, all the other I'm using the B gun, the BB gun. I'm shooting bees. <laughs> What's up, kid? Oh my god. This is <laughs> this is cool. Holy crap! Oh, I could charge up a big B. The hell does the big B do? How am I supposed to kill that armored guy? Remove five purple enemies. Oh, there they are. This doesn't really matter which way you go, just get the objective complete. There we go. I'm almost dead, dude. I'm dying. Crap! Okay. Now the objective is to just run? Oh wait, it's showing that way. Holy crap, let's go! Oh my god. What is this game? Oh, there we go, we gotta... Uh. We gotta zip back up. We completed our objectives, I believe. Oh my god. Get to hideout to secure the loot. What did we what did we unlock here? Whoa, hey, you found a box of loot. We can open it at our hideout. Alright, where's our hideout, bro? Oh my this is hectic, dude. <laughs> This is stupid fun, man. All of Behemoth's games are just stupid fun. We're supposed to transport it where? Oh my god, don't die. Oh, we had to go up, damn it. Oh, there he is. You got it.
Did I restore any health? what was going on up there like it was gonna let me select another weapon or something but i couldn't i couldn't do it i just gotta i gotta get out of here uh, i was almost dead i was right at the uh the ass edge of death oh we could destroy the enemy headquarters now let me um do my setup i don't i don't want this stupid weapon anymore Okay, it shows us the weapon being used up top. I'm gonna go with that. Okay, so you just gotta... Okay, you destroy the base and then destroy the cap. That's all. Uh, what? I was taking longer for no reason. Incoming boss. Oh, shit. I feel like I'm doing shit. I don't feel like, yeah. Blow up right next to him. Come on. I'm surprised that, like, I'm not really taking much damage so far in this stage. Unless I just didn't notice. Hell yeah! Give me all that! Mission complete! This demo version does not progress beyond mission one. Oh, We did it! Okay. So, we kept our progress in the demo. We just could start over the first mission and kind of change things up you know do things a little differently i'm assuming like it's probably like the ones that don't have the hideouts that path is probably harder i don't know but there you go i thought this was a pretty cool game i'm definitely going to be picking it up looks like like i said going to be funner with more you know, like with people online instead of a single player experience but single player was okay it was okay but i definitely see it being more fun with uh three other people playing that four player you play online or couch co-op so that's really cool appreciate you guys watching catch you on next one bye